Okay, so the simple past tense. So let's have a look. So we're talking about an action in the past that has finished. Yeah. So simple past. How do we know it's a simple past? Because we add ed at the end when it's a regular verb. So here are a few examples. We have want, which goes into wanted. Look, so looked, not looked. A lot of people say looked. That's the wrong pronunciation. So look to looked. Like to liked. Move to moved. Stop to stopped. Live to live. Arrive to arrive and work to worked. Right? So it's good to practice the pronunciation of the simple past because a lot of the times people tend to pronounce the ed at the end and it's wrong. Okay? But those are some regular verbs and just some examples of these regular verbs. Let's have a look at some popular irregular verbs. So we have eat. Eat goes to eight. Do goes to did. Go goes to went. Walk walked. Write wrote. Make made. Sleep slept. And drink drank. Okay, so those are some popular verbs that you may see, and if they're regular, you know that um, we can't add the. Um, the ed even though we've walked that is a regular verb but it's also a popular verb okay so let's have a look at the verb have so the past of have is tenere and um it stays the same whereas in the present tense it didn't it the third person changed but in this case as you can see all you have to know is your pronoun and the simple past tense so I had, you had, he, she, it had, we had, and they had. Simple, very easy. Let's have a look at the verb to be. I was, you were, he, she was, we were, and they were. Let's have a look at some examples. I ate a big breakfast. Ronaldo lived in Spain. I went to the shop to get milk. We were quite worried about the outcome. I had a party on Saturday to celebrate. Okay, so these are a few examples, a quick overview of the simple past tense. I hope this has been useful and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.